Hanukkah is the festival of lights. Instead of one day of presents, we have eight crazy nights. When you feel like the only kid in town without a Christmas tree, here's a list of the people who are Jewish, just like you and me. David Lee Roth lights the menorah. So do Kirk Douglas, James Kahn, and the late Dinah Shora. Guess who eats together at the Carnegie Deli? Bowser from Shanana and Arthur Fonzarelli. Paul Newman's half Jewish and Goldie Holmes half too. Put them together, what a fine looking Jew. Not a Jew, but guess who is Hall of Famer Rod Carew? He converted. We got Ann Landers and her sister, dear Abby. Harrison Ford's a quarter Jewish, not too shabby. Some people think that Ebenezer Scrooge is. Well, he's not, but guess who is? All three Stooges. But don't smoke my river wanaka if you really, really wanaka and the happy, 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 happy Hanaka. Happy Hanaka. That was the Hanaka song by the incomparable Adam Sandler, of course. And I need to point out he wrote three more parts to this song. That is to say, he updated it three successive times over the years since 1995 when he first played this one on Saturday Night Live putting more people, including some newer people in it. So if you don't know, if you don't recognize the names of the people in this song, but you like the general idea, check out his other versions. He's got some more updated stuff. They're all played basically the same. So what I show you as far as uh, playing it will still work for all of the other versions. And I did play this song straight from the charts of the Morristown Uke Jam. So take the link in the video description, download the free ukulele song sheet, grab your own ukulele, and you can play right along with the video. Uh, and if you'll be anywhere near Morristown, New Jersey, come out and play with us. In just a moment, I'm going to do a basic tutorial, a very short one, because it's a very simple song of everything I played. And uh, at the very end, a slow motion close-up play along that might be helpful. But right now, hey, if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up saying you like the video. If you uh, want lots more, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you want hundreds more free downloadable ukulele song sheets, each one with a link to its own free uh video tutorial and play along, then just check out our Dropbox and then just come play with us. And <clears throat> confession, I'm not actually Jewish. I'm just kind of a Jewish wannabe. So I hope you, uh, I hope you don't hate on me for playing this song. Now, okay, three chords, G, D, C. And the entire song is just those three chords. The way, generally speaking, I transition them I've got the G, right? My ring finger is on the right string. It's the only one that's on the right string transitioning to the D. So I'm just going to pick the others up. My ring finger, I keep it stuck to the ukulele. I slide down to the D. Now you notice my pinky is hovering right over that C. So I drop that, pick up the others. And then I drop the others and pick up. I don't actually have to move very much to do that, right? And now my ring finger, again, is the only one that's going to be the stability, the anchor point. It has to move up one fret, and the others drop around it. That's all the chords in the song. That's all the chords in the song. As far as the uh, the 
strums, I did three basic, mm, yeah, three basic strums, I think, or four. I'm going to stay on a G here. The first one, the, the main one used, I called it a four beat strum as opposed to a back beat, meaning you emphasize the first and third down strums. So like this. No, I'm going to switch the chords because otherwise it'll sound weird playing along. on the G. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's where the emphasis is, right? And generally speaking, I'm only actually playing it up on what would be the second up. After a, after the second down, it's like pause. You hear that up? Pause. It. And then uh, the the kind of real the kind of real uh, intro to the song. Adam plays it with single down strums like this. Hanukkah is the festival of lights, right? Just simple downs. That's it. It's not even hardly a strum. It's like my fingers just stroking across the strings. And then the arpeggio when it goes into David Lee Rock lights the the way I'm doing that, an arpeggio is a is a pattern you play with your right hand, and your left hand changes chords, but your right hand just keeps playing that pattern. I was playing the same pattern, even though the chord changed. Um, the way I'm doing this, I've got four fingers, four strong fingers, and only four strings, so I don't have to use my pinky. I've got one for each one, right? And counting from the ground, that makes this the fourth string. That's the traditional way of counting strings. That makes this the fourth string. So on the G here, four three, and then one and two together, and then back on three. That's it. That's the pattern I'm using. David Lee Roth lights the menorah. Isn't that pretty? That's it. Now, if you have a high G ukulele, my dog has fleas, it'll sound a little different, but I would still play it the same way. I would still play it the same way, and it would sound nice. It would sound different, but still very nice, and it'll also sound very, like, low-key, which is important because he's, like, edging into the song, and then he goes into the bridge. You don't need techno or jingle bell rock. Right? And all that is is emphasize all the downs. That's it. And no pausing. That's it. notice that stopped on that spot when you do that go ahead and actually put your uh, your right hand on the on the string so you stop the sound for drama both Jewish you know that's uh, that's part of part of Adam's uh, charm is drama so okay that's it that's every part of the song I am now going to play slow motion uh, up through the bridge because that includes every part of every part of the song and I'm gonna show or I'm going to even though it'll be sort of close up, include both of my hands because in this song, it's really the right hand that uh, that makes the distinctions. So here we go, slow motion. Five, six, seven, and. Put on your yarmulke. Here comes Hanukkah. So much Hanukkah to say. Hanukkah is the festival of lights. Instead of one day of presents, we have eight crazy nights. When you feel like the only kid in town without a Christmas tree, here's a list of people who are Jewish. Just like you and me, arpeggio coming. David Lee Roth lights the menorah. So do Kirk Douglas, James Conn, and the late Dinah Shura. Guess who eats together 
at the Carnegie Deli. Bowser from Shanana and Arthur Fonzarelli. Paul Newman's half Jewish and Goldie Hawn's half too. Put them together, what a fine looking Jew, and hang there for longer. Happy Hanukkah. See you Wednesday. Bye.